For those of you who share my enthusiasm, you'll surely agree that Citizen Smith ranks highly among the best classic sitcoms. So why not join me today? Grab a chair, gather around the campfire, and let's relive this fantastic show together. We'll journey through the lives of the entire cast, both past and present, paying tribute to those we've lost and celebrating those who continue to inspire. David. Kelly brought to life the character of Patty when he was 49 in 1978. He left us on February 12, 2012, at 82, in Goatstown, Dublin, Ireland, after battling an illness. Artist. Um, I went to the Gay School of Acting in 1951, and that led to... Um... But they used to be there! Oh yeah, they used to be there, sir. Well, where are they now? You're gone, miss. <laughs> Remembering Peter Egan, Peter Egan graced the sitcom with his presence as dad when he was 54, back in 1977. Sadly, he passed away on December 6, 2016, at the age of 93 in Manningtree, West Essex, England. If I'm natural, uh, I can't really add much to that. What's the name of it? Uh, they've got to have somewhere to live. Well, why don't they go and get proper homes? They wouldn't be homeless then. They can't find homes, Dad. That's why they're on your car park. We were homeless once. Robert Lindsay shown as the protagonist Wolfie Smith starting in 1977 at the age of 28. Now at 74 he's living a life full of passion in Derbyshire, England. You know. So, but um, Ilkeston was a town we supported. I was vice president of Ilkeston Town for years. Um, with, with machine guns, black blokes with hand grenades, red boys in flat jackets. Whoa, yeah. That's it. Honoring John DeCollins, John DeCollins portrayed an army officer with gusto in 1979 at the age of 37. Now 81, he lives a passionate and fulfilling life in London, UK. I'm very happy to be joining the Reflections Talent Agency. And uh, my God, it's an impulse laser. Well, that's all right, sir. It's one of ours. <laughs> you can't pick your way back to HQ. But can't we drive, sir? How can you drive? Your tank's destroyed! Hall, Cheryl Hall, captured our hearts as Philippa in 1979 at the age of 27. At 71, she's embracing life passionately in Lancaster, UK. Her character's grace and patience were always evident. She just... but she gets it wrong sometimes. Is there ever a line you say to Darren, no, we're going too far? Um, I have had moments... Shut that door! <laughs> I'm so sorry about my brother's behavior. He has one too many and loses all sense of decorum. Yeah, and he's touched. Stephen Greif played Harry Fenning in the series, starting at the age of 33 in 1977. We mourn his passing on December 23rd, 2022, at the age of 78 in Hertfordshire, England. Are good examples of that, you know. Um, whatever however changes are and how much they go against your potential. <laughs> Hello, Cyril, eh? Burke. <laughs> well, we, uh, we all make mistakes, didn't we, eh? <laughs> Hilda Braid charmed us as mom in 1977 at the age of 48. We lost her to Alzheimer's disease at 78 on November 6, 2007 in Sussex, England. Oh, you've never even met the boy. I mean, my dad didn't like you. Your dad didn't like me because I came from Yorkshire. My dad didn't like you because you used to eat gravy. Tony Millen's portrayal of Jones in 1978 when he was 37 left a lasting impression. Sadly, he passed away due to a brain tumor at 61 on July 26, 2002 in London, England. That's a four pound bag of co-op oven chips is only one pound 49 pence. 25% extra free on co-op processed or marifat pizza. <laughs> I am so pleased to meet you. I have so long wished to make your acquaintance. I am Jose Maria Ignacio de Alba. Susan Tully, who played Mandy Lynch when she was 24 in 1980, is now living a fulfilling life at 77 in London, UK. Acknowledging Mike Grady. Morning! You know. Wolfie! Yeah. There's a call for you. It's International Air Sea Rescue. 
Yeah, I'll get that bit light. Tony Selby, who played Jacko when he was 52 in 1979, sadly left us due to cancer at 73 on February 4, 2001, in England. Shirley's gonna work over there. Oh, in some Italian discotheque. <laughs> Thomas, please. Mike Grady brought character to Ken, starting in 1977 at the age of 31. He's now 77 and continues to live with Zest in CLWI. <laughs> Tucker's gonna see if he can get a vasectomy done through a bank loan. <laughs> I think I agree with that. God will solve. In 1977, at the age of 27, Cheryl Hall brought to life the character of Shirley on the sitcom that would endear her to audiences. Now, at the age of 73, Hall continues to lead a fulfilling life, embracing her passions in her home city of London, England. With my liver. Proves me point then, doesn't oh. it? Here, you've not forgotten tonight, have you? Working class heroes never forget! Donald Churchill gave us the character Murdoch in 1977 at 47 years of age. He passed away from a heart attack at 60 on October 29th, 1991, in Spain. Avenue. It's not a road, it's an avenue. <laughs> when the flash is it? Uh, quite. Well, I, I do know where this Mills chap lives. Oh, I am. Yeah. Please share your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this trip down memory lane, show some love, Hit the like button, subscribe for more, and ring the bell to stay updated.